Hello everyone, welcome back to Tech Genie. Now many times while you're starting your laptop or your Windows PC, you get a black screen that comes sometimes with the cursor and sometimes without any kind of cursor. So this can be on your both Windows 10 or Windows 11. So I will be sharing few effective solutions that you need to apply one by one. And I'm very sure by the end of this video, your problem will be fixed. So the first thing what you will have to do from your keyboard, you need to press Control Alt and the delete key all together. Then you will find this kind of lock screen. And here you need to click on task manager. And once the task manager comes up on the top here, you will find run new task. So click on it. And here you have to type explorer dot exe. Then click on OK. And after clicking this, just restart the computer and check back if the problem has been fixed. In case if this also doesn't fix, the next what you will have to do from your keyboard only, you need to press and hold the Windows, Control, Shift and the B key. I repeat Windows, Control, Shift and the B key. So once you press all these key together, the graphic card will be restarted. Sometime if the problem is because of the graphic card and once it will be refreshed, your problem will be fixed. So you can try this option as well. And in case if this also doesn't work, you need to start the computer in the advanced option. So what you will have to do, shut down the computer forcefully by pressing and holding the power button, both for your PC and laptop. Once the computer gets shut down, again, turn it on. And as soon as you find any kind of light or anything on the screen, again, forcefully shut down the computer by pressing and holding the power button. You need to repeat this step for three times. And then finally, you will be getting the advanced options. And here you will find an option of a startup setting. So click on it. Then click on restart. And then finally, you will be getting this kind of a startup setting. Now here we have to start the computer in the safe mode. And you can see that on number four, we have enable safe mode. So from our keyboard, we have to use the F4 key. So from the very top of the keyboard, you will find the F4. Just tap on it. And the computer will now be coming up in the safe mode. So you can see the login screen now. Simply log in with your pin or password. Now here click on your Windows search. Type control. Then click on control panel. Click on program and features. And here you need to find any kind of application or software that you have recently installed. And you think that after installing that software only you had a problem. So any recent software that you have installed, go ahead and uninstall it. Then from the left hand menu option only, you will find view installed update. Click on it. Now, if you think that after installing any kind of recent update, uh, then only you had a problem Then what you can do, you can just uninstall any of the latest update. Okay, so you can click on uninstall, then click uninstall again, and it will be uninstalled. So once you are done from here, Again, make a right click on the Windows icon. Then from the suggestion, click on Device Manager. In the Device Manager, first you have to look for Display Adapters. Once you get it, make a double click on it. And whichever graphic card you're using, it will be displayed here. You will have to make a right click on it and choose Uninstall Device. Check this box, then click on Uninstall. Once uninstalled, you have to look for the Monitors. Under monitors, look for your monitor, right click on it, again click uninstall device, then click uninstall again. And after that, you will have to restart the computer. So let me quickly restart. And this time you will find that the windows is coming up without any kind of problem. So that's all guys. Hopefully these all solution will work for you. And this is the only best solution to fix black screen with cursor or without any kind of cursor. And if you find this video helpful, do not forget to like and subscribe and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.